I'm here with my dear friend, Dr. Morris Sorello, the man of God right here. You all know him. The Lord has blessed millions through his amazing life, and we're standing on Amen. holy ground. Absolutely. Doc, come on. Tell the people what you told me about this. Well, we Right are, on the highway, by the we way. We are here standing on 18 acres that we acquired to build God a legacy center. Legacy center right in San Diego. Now, this has a lot to do with yourself, Benny. Because, How's that? Well, because the Lord said to me, son, I do not want this ministry that I have given to you that has touched millions of people and hundreds of thousands of preachers. God said, I don't want it to die. And it was right there on my knees when he spoke that, that I got up and said, I have to build God a legacy center. And then the Lord said, son, it's not only for yourself and for your legacy, but it's going to be for great men of God that I have raised up so their messages, their ministry will go on after I take them home. And now, you and I love Ken. We absolutely, of course. What, what's left? Not a whole lot, no. no, no, no. no. I mean, what's, what's left is what, we, what we've seen. Yeah. yeah. And it's, just, it's a crisis that there isn't something that God gave to her that could keep going on and on and on. Well, just take a look. 18 Show incredible, them, will you, Tim? 18 incredible acres. And you know, there's one thing, Benny, that God has taught you in your life. Never do anything. Never. And so we are right here in the middle of the most incredible, valuable place across the way. Show the highway, Tim. Right there is the highway is here in San Diego. And there is the biggest shopping center. And there's center. hotels and a shopping center right over there. Nordstrom's Nordstrom's over there, moving there. Wow. Uh, uh, the uh, restaurants, all the major biggest restaurants. And, and they just began work here like what? Well, we just a little now, while ago, right? What you're looking at on these grounds is dirt. But on this dirt stood a 200-room hotel that was about 50 years old. And we bought it and we operated it for three or four years while we got all the permits from the yeah. city. And by the way, the city just voted legacy. We want legacy here in San Diego. Oh, come on. He is in his 80s, sweet people. The energy, we were praying earlier and he was holding my arm and he was squeezing me and I thought, my Lord, <laughs> strong. Well, we had to pray a strong prayer. Yeah, and we did. But I want to tell you something. And this is something that is so exciting. You, you mentioned Catherine Hooman. Yes. For you, for me, for anyone today to see any of Catherine Kuhlman's material or listen to radio program, we have to go to Wheaton College to see it. Now, yeah, it is a shame. Now, while I worked with them, thank God, I was able to get a whole lot of the radio program myself. I have hundreds of them in my house, hundreds of them. Today, you can't even find them because you have to go to Wheaton College to even look at them. And who's going to go to fly to Wheaton College to go see some of Catholics. So we can preserve them right here. I'm here you to tell you, word. I have, I, the Lord gave me the divine door that when I worked with the Catherine Kuhlman Foundation, I got hundreds of radio programs I still have in my home. <laughs> and we've heard them in the car, Tim and I, many times. Some of them we haven't even heard. There's hundreds of them. And I have many of her uh, TV programs Wonderful. in my home. Wonderful. Yeah. So who knows how God will use that. Yeah. But here you are standing on what I believe is holy ground. Mm -hmm. uh, that very soon 
by the what now? I hear by the end of next year. By the end of uh, December in nineteen. Twenty nineteen. Okay. That's next year. Okay. This, this yeah. will open to the glory of God. Two hundred thousand square feet. A learning center that will be unequal because it will have the ministries of people like Penny Hinn preserved. The Lord's going to take him and I home. And when he does, we want to have the ministry. God Continue, said, yeah. God said, so, don't so let it die. People will come here yes. and see what? Well, there's a hotel, like a rich car, the most exquisite, beautiful hotel. where the But people... you were telling me about Israel. They, oh, yes. You'll be able to visit Israel all yes. from here. Right. Please explain well, that to them. You know, there's a ride in Disneyland. You get onto the chair and it flies you all over California. Well, we have contracted a hundred of those seats with the manufacturer. The same in people that Germany, they put his name right? And the same, same uh, engineers and the same technicians and the same designers. And we've got two theaters, one seating a hundred, where you get into the seat, but we are not going to fly you over California. We're going to fly you over, over Jerusalem. <laughs> You're going to go to Jerusalem. You're going to go to the Dead Sea. You're going to go to the Sea of Galilee. You're going to go to Gethsemane. You, you're going to visit Golgotha, the Garden yeah. Tomb. Woo! You're going to visit the Gethsemane, yeah. you're going to visit uh, Via Dolorosa, yes. the Praetorium, on and on and on. Be great. And What an amazing and experience. And the film is already done. It's all done. The film is already okay. done. So think about coming to San Diego and visiting Israel, right here. Amen. Being able to sit in a, and like, like a theater, right? Sa saving yeah. saving 3000 to $5,000. The cost yeah, to of fly a there. To fly to Israel. Well, I think they're gonna come here and yeah. then decide to go there. Yeah. But the thing is that it's so amazing is you're gonna have more than just what you said. Like there'll be other ministries like Catherine Kuhlman. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. There are going to be halls of faith giving the what's do to great men that the world has forgotten. Well, and we don't want them to forget. What we, God we, has you know, we are living today in a in a in a time when most young people have not heard the name, believe it or not, Oral right. Roberts. I've asked us, have you heard of Oral Roberts? No. And I'm thinking, where do these kids come from? Some planet? Have you heard Catherine? Uh-uh. It's a new generation. Now, some have, some have. But if if you go back before that, they still don't know who they are. They may way more don't know. We want to preserve that to make sure that 20 years from now, 50 years from now, should, should the Lord carry, that people can come here and look at ministries, healing ministries and other ministries that have touched the world and be a part of it. That's what you're doing. And there is a learning system that we are developing called the e-learning system. And when we have it complete, it's all... What do you mean by a learning system, Doc? Well, people will be able to sit in their home and through being able to connect with the Legacy Center in Nigeria, in Indonesia, in the nations of the world, we'll be able to train nationals. Right now, I'm going to 30 different nations this year. So you can train pastors right from, from the from legacy here. center. That's the vision. They can all come to America you, for conferences. 90% or more of most preachers in the world have been touched by this man. Over 90%. Everywhere I go, South America, Central America, Africa, you name it. 
I've had people come to me and say, Dr. Sorella is starting my life. Pastors. And many, many, many of them are your, your, your sons. spiritual sons and daughters. Amen. Yes. I'm one of them. You people don't know this. 1972, I went to hear Dr. Sorello in Toronto at a hotel called Constellation Hotel. I just got saved and went with the kids from the church. And while he was ministering, I felt a hand touch me right here. A real hand. And I looked around, there was a the kids, you know, around me were all worshiping, so no one was touching me. And it happened three times. And then I heard the Lord's voice audibly. He said, I need you. I need you. He was in his meeting. Later, I went to Catherine Kuhlman, and that's when the Lord changed everything. But, you know, you're still with us. And, and if you goodness now what a year or two ago he had a he had a hole in his leg right here and we all thought he was gonna go that's right huh? I, was, I was paralyzed I was bed fast for almost one year I had to be moved around in a wheelchair well, I, could I not remember. walk you came and visited Listen, me. The hole in his in his leg was that about big. this big. Am I about right? Twice that size. Huh? Twice that size. It's, it's a little, a little yeah, more like that. Yeah. I was trying to be conservative, but anyways, and and it went all the way in, and he was on medication, couldn't walk, and and we all thought, and when I came to see you, more than once, I thought, this is goodbye, you know. But God healed him. It's, completely it, and close the and whole close of my the hole. the hole is gone guys yeah, is gone. it's gone well, totally totally gone you can't, you can't see, see it the, with the uh, stocking but the hole is gone and they gave him med uh, medication they didn't know what's going to happen the lord healed dr sorello instantly <laughs> i mean it was an instant and you feel I the energy a, i got up the out of the wheelchair <laughs> instantly no pain Nothing there no. to even, maybe a little mark, I guess. I don't know. No, I don't, Not even a mark. No skin. No huh? no it's all new skin. Pastor Gary here, yeah. that I've known for ages and ages and yeah. ages. <laughs> I used to preach for this man right outside uh, Philly, right? Right outside yeah. Philly. Yeah. 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 And and you've you've known Dr. Sorello for a long time, yeah. and you can you can be an, a witness like me. We all thought he was going to go to heaven. And no, look at the energy, you know, <laughs> the Lord, the Lord kept him alive to, to finish this. Jesus, I give it up. My God is faithful. My God is faithful. Thank you. Pray for the people, God. Yes, my God. Father, you are spirit. Yes, Lord. And that's the reason why you can be on these grounds as we stand on this dirt. Yes. At the same time, you are in every home. Every person is watching at this moment, and we ask you, please, invoke the purpose of the stripes in your son's back, and he Tim, show the property one more time, because go around all the way. It starts way back there and goes all the way up. And that way, right to where it says Courtyard Marriott. It's all the way to, those to that hotel. And then you see across the way here is the highway. Look, look at that. That's a miracle from God himself to give Bavaria Christ here, right on, on, on this freeway in San Diego, California. And by the end of next year, the building will be ready. And this is being built debt free. Debt free, guys. Debt free. free. Think about that. Thank you, but, Lord. But pray, though we're, our goal is debt free, we got a big, big financial hurdle to overcome. The Lord's going to give it to you. But God yes. has yes. done it step by step by step. What we see here. Mm is debt free. Well, think about two people are, are going to come here and receive the anointing for ministry. Amen. Yes. And travel the world. 
more self, and more will be self. thousands of them will be trained in the spirit. What a mighty, mighty God we serve. Hey, hey, hey. Love you so much.